What's up, y'all? This your girl, Go Mouth. Um, I just got done dropping Scooby off to school, and I am sitting at the track right now. Um, as you guys know, today is doctor day for me, and it's yeah, I know I'm not gone yet. My appointment is in the afternoon, kind of like evening, so not evening in the afternoon, so um, it's not quite time yet. Um, my husband is home today because, you know, he has to take me, obviously. And um, he was going to take Scooby to school this morning, but I was like, no, I'm going to get on up because I wanted to, you know, I wanted to come vlog and talk to y'all because I felt like it'll make me feel better because last night I was having, uh, I, I, I was kind of like nervous, I would say, because, uh, you know, anxiety, I, I start feeling a sense of anxiety. Um when it's time to go to the doctor. Now, I've been feeling good all week, and then today is like, ugh, well, I, I'm okay right now. I'm okay right now, but it, last night, I was, every little thing, like, bothered me. Every little thing made me upset. Every little thing, um, you, I guess it's kind of like when your nerves bad type situation. I don't even know how to explain it, but, uh, that's every like little stuff was just making me so upset last night and it wasn't even necessary for me to be upset so i'm like let me go take scooby to school so i can get out of the house let me take my glasses off because i see this glare but yeah so i i brought scooby to school and my husband was supposed to so but anyways we flipped the script i ended up bringing him so anyways i got two appointments today one appointment is with radiology oncology which is I have to do a CAT scan. The next appointment is I have to actually go to the infusion center. Infusion is another name for chemo, if you if you don't know. Infusion is another name for chemotherapy. And um, I have to go to that place today and um, do get checked. Uh... It's hard for me to go there because I I get like flashbacks and memories of people because it's the people there. The people at the infusion center, a lot of them are sick, sick, like with cancer. And you can tell because most of them are bald. Some of, some of them wear the bald heads. Most of them have on like a, a, a rag or, or a scarf or something. And it just kind of gives me flashbacks of, you know, where I've been. But I, I'm not sad for them. Well, I don't know. That's not good. I, I'm not sad. I'm not. It doesn't make me sad. It, it, it just it just gives me memories of where I was. But. I, it can also be a good thing and a bad thing because I, I can look at them and, and, and thank God uh, I'm not feeling sick like that anymore. But at the same time, I feel, I don't know how to explain it. I just don't know. Um, But I, I don't feel good when I'm in that place. I just don't. I just don't because I know what those people are going through firsthand. I know how they're feeling. I know all of that, and I know it doesn't feel good, you know. So for me to be back up in there, it kind of gives me flashbacks of what I went through, but in a bad way and in a good way because I can look at them and say, look how far I've come. Thank you, Jesus. And then I can also be like, God, that feeling sucks. And so I don't even be knowing how to feel. I shouldn't feel like nothing when I go in there, but the truth, the truth is, truthfully, I do. I can't, like, say, oh, I'm just going. It's going to be a piece of cake. It, it's easy. It's easier said than done. Trust me. It's easier said than done. Um, but I got to do it. And I, I, I hate that I got to do it. I honestly do, but it's got to be done. Um, after this appointment... I have another. I have another appointment on Thursday. So on Thursday, I had to go to the radi radiation department again, so they can do a another checkup because I get checkups by two different doctors because they have two different opinions. So my chemo doctor will check me, and then my radiation doctor will also check me again. I don't have to get another scan. The radiation doctor will check me 
um, physically again, along with the chemo doctor, physically. Um, so I had to get like a physical today and then another one Thursday. It's the same procedure, just two different doctors because they work together as a team um, to make sure, okay, what he said, and I'm going to check and see what he said is what he said right you know i don't i don't understand how it's kind of getting like a second opinion all in one because the first doctor will be like okay i see this and then the second doctor will be like nah i don't know how you saw this when i saw this if he sees something different you know or if he sees anything at all he's not going to see anything at all because first doctor gonna say i didn't see nothing and the second doctor gonna say i didn't see nothing that's in my head so y'all in reality it's not easy for me to, to go every month. It costs to fill up this truck $65 to fill this truck up. This is a big truck. Um, so I have to worry about that. Then I also have to worry about the $40 copay. I got to pay the $40 copay to, to get the CAT scan. I also got to pay the $40 copay to go to the doctor afterwards then thursday i gotta pay the 40 dollar copay to um hold on okay y'all so i was getting a little hot um i i had to pay the 40 dollar copay to go to the the second doctor let me put it this way so um yeah it's a, it's a lot of money involved we got to fill the truck up going there and fill and fill it halfway up coming back because we burn half half over half of the tank. I don't know. I guess we just need a new vehicle that takes less gas or something. But, hey, one day. So, besides all of that, um, I'm feeling okay. Um, I've been feeling good all week, y'all. I feel like I'm starting to not be okay. Just maybe because I'm talking to y'all. I don't know, but I feel like I need somebody to talk to. But it's kind of hard out here. <laughs> Uh, I don't. Even, I really can't even tell you guys too much. Hold on, let me get my thoughts together, and I'll be right back. <laughs> okay, y'all. So here I go. <laughs> okay, so today is. Okay, it's it's gonna be a good day. It's gonna be a good day, y'all. I, I can. I, I'm, I'm just gonna come to y'all truthfully, truthfully, and, and let you guys see. The things that I go through, my feelings, my emotions, um, as far as far as it, as far as going to the doctor is, is concerned, it's it's not easy for me to, not yet. Maybe maybe down the line it'll get easier, but for right now it's still it it hasn't even been a year yet since my last treatment. My last treatment was in July of 2017, so my memories are fresh that was my last that was my last chemo radiation treatment but i had a couple of scans that i had some run-ins with which led to surgery and biopsies and stuff like that so that was when i got my last checkup so when they said they saw something so this time i'm doing it again so we just gonna pray to god that you know everything is great okay so, y'all, sometimes it's hard for me to find a smile in the midst of it all. No matter what people, no matter, I don't know, it, it might it might do matter. Because a lot of times when y'all come in, it makes me feel like so much better that I've came to y'all. I've talked, y'all said something good, so now I'm reading it and I feel better, okay? <sighs> My daughter's appointment is in a, in a couple more hours. I'm going to post this video before I go. Just to let you guys know, I'm going to post this video before I go. And then I'm actually going to do a vlog going to the doctor. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to post it on this channel or my other channel. Because I know I have a lot of people on my other channel. Including you guys that like to see uh, my doctor appointment updates. So uh, either way, I just do two. I can do two and um, just leave the, that one as a vlog. Okay, so, um, they doing the most, I really feel like doing this whole video over, like, I really, really feel like doing this whole video over, just because 
every little thing like irking my nerves right now. Um, so I just probably keep it rolling. It, I'm at the center, so there's a lot of kids and stuff out today for the summer, so it's a lot of noise going around me. Every little little noise is just like, ah, I'm getting frustrated. So I, I, I kind of feel like I need peace and quiet, but I also need to come and talk to you guys just to, just to get a little bit of energy off my chest at the same time. But I don't want to put, like, sad energy or negative energy out there in the atmosphere. I want to still be smiling <laughs> and happy. Um... So that's what I'm trying to do this morning. Hopefully my smile will make somebody smile because somebody better be smiling right now. <laughs> this is hard, y'all. So um, I'm just going to end this video right here because I think I said enough. Um, thank you guys who've been buying bonnets recently. I think I'm going to end this video right here because I've said enough. This just this just is what it is. Um, thank you guys who've been buying bunnets recently in the last couple days, actually, last night and this morning. That helped me tremendously. I am going to go home now and uh, put bunnets together so I can come out again and go to the post office. I'm probably just going to vlog all day because I feel like I need somebody to talk to. So stay tuned to the next video. I'm going to end this video right here. Thank you guys for coming along with me. That's all I got to say in this video. And I will holler at y'all later. Bye.